What's up guys, what's going on? This is Ram from Archie Hitch Tech TV and this is yet another video on uh, tips and tricks with Moto E. So I've already made a video on tips and tricks with Moto E. I'll link that at the end of the video and you can watch that. So let's get started with part 2. Starting from the lock screen itself, you can add widgets. So uh, by default it will be disabled. So to enable that, go to home screen, go to settings and go to security and there you have the option to enable the widgets right so let's get back to lock screen and now swiping from left to right you can add the widgets so let's add messaging app so now you can access the messaging app from the lock screen itself so that's really cool and if you don't want this you can remove this right press and hold and remove right so easy so you can add multiple widgets to your lock screen so the next cool thing is you can access Google now from lock screen itself and to do that press and hold this arrow mark and drag right so you can access Google now that's really cool and another cool feature is uh, you can access uh, the owner information in the lock screen itself or you can display the owner information on the lock screen so to do that go to settings security owner information and there you go enable this and type in the text so for sample let's type in like hello and let's see like if this gets displayed there you go hello right so this comes in pretty handy if you have lost your phone right so if you type in some meaningful information so the other person can contact you and uh, give back your phone right okay so the next thing is in last video I showed you like uh, how to bring applications from app tray to home screen or how to make folders on the home screen right so now I'll tell you like uh, how to remove the applications from the home screen press and hold any application and then remove that right don't worry this will not be uninstalled so but you just can not remove uh, from the home screen and uh, so next thing is how to in uninstall the application right so let's go to settings applications bbc news and uninstall but uh, this is a bit of long process so the best process i would say is go to app tray select the app you want to uninstall press and hold right you have that option to uninstall drag and drop it so it'll ask you like if you want to uninstall if you press ok it'll be uninstalled right so it's very easy and uh, so next question is uh, you have this magnification gesture and for that go to accessibility settings accessibility and there you have the magnification gestures what the what this does is if you tap three times it'll magnify that thing for you like I'll show you like right so it's magnified now and with one finger you can move between the home screens and with two fingers you can navigate right you can move the whole page so this is really cool and uh, to get back to the normal position again tap three times right so easy and uh, the next question is uh, you can end the calls through the power button so to do that you have to enable it go to accessibility and uh, power button ends call right so enable this and whenever you get a call if you hit the power button so you can disconnect the call right or you can end the call right so I guess that's it guys so if you have enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up and for more videos like this subscribe to my channel thank you guys